Nigerian women unanimously chanting for a nation where all women and girls would be free from violence and harmful practices. Nigeria had been selected as one of the priority countries of Africa. Focus will be on prevention, particularly addressing the root cause of gender-based violence and harmful practices. It's one of the visible political and financial investments from the EU to the tune of about 500 million euros. And it's going to bring peace, unity amongst us in our city and in Nigeria in general. The event is the inception of the Spotlight Initiative, where relevant arms of government, development partners, and civil society organizations are strategizing to reawaken the consciousness of Nigerian women to speak out against all forms of violence and also take advantage of institutions and mechanisms in place to give them justice. The culture of silence has led to the deaths of numerous women and we cannot continue to bury women and girls. So they need to speak up as a woman, even if it's your husband that is violating your child, you should speak up. The whole fear of stigma should not stop you from saving your child because the interest of your child should be paramount rather than just safeguarding the name of the family. So we are looking at capacity building of institutions, identifying the specific institutions that are supposed to be working in this area and how to um, ensure that we can support them. We are also looking at um, social norms. When you see something, say something is a popular phrase the gathering is now adapting to move away from talking to real action. Momso Damien Nati, NT News.